back with another requested review. This one is by Model Model. It's one of the clean cap wig collection protective style. This one is called number 15. That's the style. And I'm wearing her in the color 1B. It do come in some other colors. Not so much, but it do come in some other colors that I will leave in the description box so you can check it out. And I'll leave a link to the website as well so you can go purchase it if you want to and you can see the price and everything on there. But anyway guys, this as you can tell is a full wig with a blunt bang. What I like about this is that the bangs are not too full. I really like full bangs. Trust me, I love full blunt bangs. But this one is not too thick, but at the same time it's not too thin. So you see through it like a tiny bit, but it looks pretty natural. It doesn't look, you know, like too bulky and then it doesn't look too spacious. To me, it looks pretty natural. You guys can tell me what you think in the description box below. I did not have to tr um, trim this or anything. I just put it on and brushed it that was it I didn't have to do anything so you can pull it down to how like low you want your bangs to be or you can pull it back a little bit more if you want to I love my bangs like right over my <laughs> right on like my eyelashes I love bangs like that the curly one that I previously reviewed no, that one is different. That one was just different. I think it looked better when you can see my eyebrows. But with this one, like any straight bangs, I prefer it like right over my eyelashes. But anyway, I think it looks really cute. It's pretty much a basic, um, like a bang cut straight. Um, it's not too long. You have it's longer at the front and shorter at the back, but just a tad bit shorter at the back. Not too much of a difference. But I like it. I think that the length is pretty good. You can always hold it in a ponytail if you want to. Get it out of your face. It's not much hair back here, but it's still something, you know? It's still something. <laughs> but anyway, um, in terms of like, um, he put, like he, it can take heat up to 400 degrees, so you can always flat iron it. In terms of the texture, it feels a lot like the Canaclon braid in here. Not the rough one that actually bruises your finger, but the soft, the really, really soft Canaclon braid in here. It's super, super soft. I can't stress that enough. No tangling or anything like that. No snags or nothing. It's super, super soft and lightweight. So I really like that about it. I don't like the way it looks because I really don't like that Canaclon look but the feel of it trust me it's super super soft so i really like the feel of it in terms of shedding i did i think i did get like a few strands but wasn't anything like excessive nothing to really talk about um i say that all the time right nothing to talk about but i still say it <laughs> but yeah i got a few strands just a tiny bit and it comes with care instructions on the back of the sock card so if you want to know how to wash it and everything it will be back there this is what the sock card looks like if i didn't show you already i'm not sure but yeah this is what the sock card looks like and like i said i'll leave a list of the colors and everything in the description box now in terms of the cap you get one huge comb up front like right underneath the bang area there's a long comb right there and then there's one at the back together with the adjustable straps it's a basic cap construction i would say it's about small to medium in size it feels like it would definitely stretch to fit a larger head size so keep that in mind although it's small to medium in size because if it's pretty snug it will definitely stretch to fit a larger head size so anyway guys i think that's about it for this unit if i forgot to mention anything leave me a question in the comment section down below i'll be sure to answer it as soon as possible don't forget to like and subscribe follow us on instagram at wake times and i'll see you pretty soon bye bye